Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Lakin. If you're new here, welcome. So glad you could be here and join us. So I have a Marshalls haul. What do you know? Who would have guessed it? Um, another one. But today is my birthday and I did some shopping a few days ago. Um, got some birthday money. Always fun. And I did a little bit of shopping. So I wanted to show you what I got. So if you're interested, then just keep watching. Also, my daughter is having a sleepover tonight with a few of her friends, so if you hear screaming little girls running around in the background, that's what that is. No worries. Okay, so let's get into the bag. Okay, so I'm going to start off with the makeup because I know most of you are here for that reason alone, and then I'll show you the clothes and other things that I got. So, yeah, let's get started. Okay, the first thing I'm pulling out is this. Bare Minerals Marvelous Moxie Lipstick in the shade Take Charge. And this is just a nude brown shade. And I don't think it is matte. I think this is more of like a satin finish. And I'm not wearing any lipstick now. We just got back from Olive Garden. And I wanted to try this on, on the video for you guys. Just to see if I like it. It's in a really cute, pretty sleek lipstick case and you like push <laughs> well it isn't broken so that's good but this is what it looks like really pretty so let's see what all right and then you just Pop it back in and it locks back into place. So that's pretty nifty. Oh, it fell out. <laughs> Maybe it's not that nifty. You know, it's probably a user error as usual with me. Okay. Got it in there good that time. So yeah, so I really like this lipstick. It feels really creamy and I don't know. I really like this. It's not like thick. It just feels really, really nice on the lips. So, and I like the color. What do you think? All right. So let's see what's next. Okay. The next thing I found was this Smashbox step-by-step -step contour kit. And it is just a highlighting shade, not like a highlight, but like an under eye highlighting shade like a banana powder, a pressed banana powder. And then it has a bronzer and a contour shade in here. And it also comes with a Smashbox brush. Okay, so here's what it looks like on the outside. And then here is the inside and it comes with like a little face map to show you where to highlight and contour. I have already swatched these, but this is the highlight, which you put like under your eyes and you know, anywhere that you want to highlight your face. And then this is the bronzer and this is the contour shade. So there's those. Let me swatch them for you. I swatched them for myself already, but I guess I can swatch them for you guys too. Oh, and it is so creamy. Okay, I don't know that that will really show up a whole lot on camera, but these are really, really soft. And I've only swatched them. I haven't actually used them yet. But they are super pigmented and creamy and soft and like buttery. I can't wait to try these. So there's that. And let's see the brush that it comes with. Okay, it's just a cute little red contour brush. I guess I could go ahead and try it. I mean, I already have makeup on, but what the heck? So I'm just gonna try the contour shade. Good bit of fallout, I will say that much. Mm, so it 
is a little more cool toned, but that's okay. I really like this. Let's just blend it out a little bit. I really like it. Next, I'm pulling out this Too Faced Bulletproof 24 Hour Eyeliner, and this is the Ooh and Ah shade, and it's just a black shade. And I already have like a silver one and a teal one, and I knew I liked those, so I went ahead and picked up black because I knew I would probably use this one the most. And these are only $5 at my Marshalls, and you get a lot of product. I mean, that's pretty thick. And you can use it as eyeliner or eyeshadow, so that's pretty sweet, too. So I'll go ahead and swatch it. And it does have some glitter in it. I don't know if you can see it, really, but it does have a little bit of a reflect like black with maybe gold or silver glitter. I think it's silver. So yeah. Next thing I'm pulling out is this Skin Lab Micellar Cleansing Water. This removes makeup, clarifies, and tones. No rinse and no scrub. And this was in the clearance section for $3. I've used the Jean-Pierre one and the Garnier one. And I saw this one in the clearance section. I figured I would give it a shot as well. Okay, the next thing I'm pulling out is this Faced Melted Kisses and Sweet Cheeks Long Lasting Lip and Cheek Duo. And these are just some minis. It is a mini lipstick and blush. So they're so small, but they're really, really cute. And this is the shade Love Flush Justify My Love. It's a 16 hour blush. So I haven't tried it. I don't know if it'll really last 16 hours, but. So there's that. I don't know if I'm gonna swatch it yet because I might be giving this one to my sister and her. Uh, this one's already been squeezed a little bit. Ugh. Well, I was going to give it to my sister in her little graduation gift set. I've already got a few other things in there, but she had a Too Faced eyeshadow palette and eyeliner, and this would have been cute little something to go with it, and it's like pretty bow packaging because she graduates this weekend, so I've been getting stuff together for that. But yeah, so there's that, and then this one is the shade Peony, or Peony, however you say it. Just like pink. All right, the next thing I'm pulling out is from the Creme Shop. This is 100% human hair eyelashes. And these are the wispy black ones. And yeah, this is what they look like. Pretty dramatic, but wanted to try these. These were very appealing to me and I wanted been, I've been wanting to try different lashes lately. So I make cakes and because it's my birthday and my daughter's birthday, we're going to the beach next week and I was going to make us a birthday cake for like us together and I came across these candles and I thought they'd be really cute on our cake. These are only two dollars. Really cute and they're glittery. So that was all for the makeup and now I'm going to get into the clothes and other stuff. So, Alright, so first of all, I have been obsessed with cute mugs lately. I don't know if it's because they're like more readily available now or what, but I have this new obsession with cute coffee mugs. So if you want me to do like 
a coffee mug collection video. I could totally do that at this point because I have enough to do that now. <laughs> So yeah, so I got these coffee mugs. I think this one was like $3 and this one was like $2 and they were on sale. So thought they were cute. This one says hello pretty and this one's a little more plain. It's really cute. It is chipped right here though. So you have to be careful. I didn't realize that. That's probably why it's on clearance, but it's still really adorable. Really adorable. And so a few of the clothes I'm actually wearing right now. I got this like, I don't even know what this is called. I'm so bad with clothes, you guys. Like, I don't know what things are called or what's like in style. If it's just cute to me, I grab it and, you know, it's a cover. It's a help me out in the comments. I'm sure you will. But it is just floral and you guys know how much I love floral. And this is by Angie. It's just like green with the red flowers, floral print, and then it's got this going down the back. Really super cute and comfy. And then I got this like yellow t-shirt. It's really soft. So there's that and let me get the rest of the stuff. Okay, first thing I'm pulling out are these shorts. These are American Eagle shorts. These were $10. These fit me very well and they are a little more modest and a little longer so that's what I've been looking for and I'm finally starting to find some. Okay so as some of you know um, if you've been watching me for a while you know that I just recently weaned my toddler from breastfeeding so um, I mostly only wear nursing bras and that's what I've been wearing for two years just because that's what I had to wear. And they're kind of getting worn out and I'm ready to go back to regular bras. So I picked up a cute bra and panty set to go ahead and get me started. And I'm wearing one of them right now. I'm not going to show you. It's, it's skin colored or nude. And then I got this cute Laura Ashley bra. It's floral and gray. And then here's some matching undies to go with it. thought those were adorable they're not like super sexy or anything but come on now i've been married for a while and i mean i have plenty of lingerie but this is just so cute to me okay so there's that we're going to the beach next week and next month i went ahead and picked up another bathing suit because i only had two one pieces and one was from last summer and then the one i ordered on amazon doesn't really fit that great so I tried on a few and I found this one that I thought looked really great on me. It is a one piece and it is blue. This is what it looks like. I know it doesn't look great like just hanging here, but it's really super cute on. And it was only $25 and like I went on Venus and I found one and it looked almost exactly like this and it was like $70. So I'm glad I saved some money there. So yeah, so there's my bathing suit and I like to have a few bathing suits, especially on vacation because if you get it wet and then you take it off and then you want to go back out, it just feels so cold and icky to put on a wet bathing suit. I cannot stand that. So I like to have a few with me just so I can throw on a dry one and the other one can hang up to dry for the next time. <laughs> If that makes any sense. Am I weird? Does anybody else do? I found these really, really soft burgundy shorts. I love this color. They're like a berry burgundy color. These are only $7. They are by Hot Kiss. And they are still a little long. Or Let me remind you, I'm really short. But these are so soft and comfy and really cute on. So I got these plain yellow tank top from Zanana Outfitters. It was $5. Really soft material. I'm all about soft stuff these days. Um, I just want to be comfortable. Okay, next I'm pulling out this nightgown. I love nightgowns, especially like this vintage kind of style nightgown lately. They're just my favorite. Really soft again, and this was on sale for $13, and this is by Marissa Christina. I know it's kind of hard to see these. I really need to do a try-on haul. I just never seem to have the time lately. 
I film when I can and usually this is the best I can do for you guys. Hopefully in the future it'll get easier, but right now this is what we're working with. Hope you don't mind. I think this is the last thing and this is just a little Japna tank top. And it's like crisscrossed in the back and the front and it's a really cute like summery kind of flowy little tank top this it was $13 it was not on sale but still a great price so thought that was really adorable and yeah that is everything for this Marshalls haul so I hope you enjoyed this and if you did please don't forget to like and subscribe down below i would really greatly appreciate it and thank you all so much for watching i love you and jesus loves you too god bless you all bye